And you know, for that period, for about two years, when Kenyatta was president and Jaramugi was his vice president, you would go to State House, I would go to State House as Attorney General, and uh, Jaramogi and Muse will be in, the, in his office, and you couldn't get in. You are not allowed. It struck us that these are not only political uh, working together, but they are great friends. There has been a delay, I appreciate, and some of the donors have been very concerned about this uh, delay, but there's been consultation, and the president must take his own time in uh, appointing whoever he wishes to, to, to appoint as the, as the director. And uh, now we have one, so welcome, Richard. I respect presidency, the office of the president, as an institution. And I would like that institution to be used for the good of the nation. Just come to this building after, I think it must be 15, 20 years. And I'm really astounded and I'm ashamed that the courts, court of justice sh should be in the, s in the way it is at the moment. Do you know, when I was here, we used to our motto was that we are practicing law under blind goddess. The law does not see, the law has no hands. But now, those who practice law here have hands and they seem to have eyes. Now, when you have eyes, you, you get tempted. And it is said that we, we, we have reached a stage like that in our country. And I also appeal to my Brother Raila, here, to buy, to buy for the party ticket. And if he wins, to run for the presidency, for what, it is, what is wrong with the rural uh, president uh, in this country. Jamahuri 63, we will never forget what we felt as a, as a nation, uh, to, to, to feel free, to be free, and to see the flag going up to Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta to show statesmanship and lead young people from central uh, Kenya into ODM and vie inside there for the party's ticket. Ninaona hasira sana kuona central province was misled kusema ya kwamba hii Referendum, ilikuwa referendum ya kikuyu na watu wengine. It is unfortunate that since the Bomas process moved to the referendum on the proposed constitution, this country has seen incredible tribal-based division. I particularly want to say that the Kikuyu community was then and still is isolated from all other community. I'm not saying that they are isolated by other communities, they themselves have isolated themselves. Such a division has never been experienced nor seen even at the worst moments in Kenyan's history. What we should now do is to go back to what our law used to be. The justice would dispense under the shadow of the blind goddess. On top of this building, that you come here in these law courts, hoping and trusting that you are going to get justice and you are not going to pay for it. And I hope, I hope that this will happen and we help we know we keep on talking about corruption. You, unless you yourself are clean, you cannot talk about corruption with conviction. At whatever political price or sacrifice to me as a person, I can no longer remain silent and watch as tribalism 
tears this nation apart. As an opinion leader, I am not free of blame for the unacceptable state of affairs. Indeed, I accept to share this blame because we must speak about our country when things are going wrong. I may have said something which really is not uh, in the interest of our country. 